Hey guys! So today I'm going to teach you guys how to do this bold springtime look with a bunch of bright colors and pastels. I actually wore this recently to a wedding and liked how it turned out and I actually filmed something for it, a get ready with me, but <laughs> I'm an idiot and instead of filming I just took a picture of myself and then got halfway through the video, video and realized that there was no video so <laughs> whoops. So if you'd like to see this look, just keep watching. So first we're gonna start off with a base. So I'm just using this white concealer. I'm gonna pat this all over my eyelids. So we're gonna start off with a bright yellow. And we're gonna use this one right here. It's like a very true bright yellow. I'm gonna use some of this e.l.f. Makeup Mist Spray, setting spray. I'm just gonna spray that onto this little card from my phone. And then you're just gonna dip your brush in it a little bit. And this helps um, make the colors more pigmented and since we're using bright colors, they'll show up more if you use this. Then we're just going to flip the brush over and dip it in more of that setting spray. And then we're gonna use this bright orange, well, it's not really that bright, just orange, just normal orange right here. And blend that into the yellow on the outer part of your eyelid. And then we're gonna take more of the setting spray on this dome-shaped brush and use that in this bright orangey pink color right here. I don't know if you can see that because I can't even see myself. And we're going to do windshield wiper motions in the crease, but with this color in particular in my palette, a little bit goes a long way with this one because it actually shows up a lot pretty much so just a little bit I'm just distributing these equally on both eyes so I don't get too much and I'm just going to take this skinny brush and use the setting spray again just dip into that and we're going to use this bright purple right here and put that in the outer corner And then we're going to blend out the harsh lines. It's not so dramatic. And then let's get to the bottom lash line. But first, before we do that, um, we're gonna take a white eyeliner and just apply this to the lower waterline. We are going to apply a light blue right over that color into the crease. So I'm just taking no setting spray this time because it'll show up. I'm taking this light powder blue right here and we're gonna apply that to the lower water line. Now eyes look like a straight up rainbow, but I promise you that it won't look as crazy when we put on eyeliner. So let's do that. I'm just using my liquid liner from um, Rimmel London and I'm just going to make my plain old winged eyeliner as usual.
Now that that's done, we're just going to curl our lashes and apply mascara. I'm using the mascara I'm using is the um, One by One Volume Express from Maybelline, which is my favorite mascara at the moment. All right, so that's it for the eyes, and now we'll move on to the rest of the face. I'm just gonna apply some bronzer. I'm using my NYC Sun and Bronze in Fire Island Tan. And we're just going to contour first using my bronzer brush. Just under the cheekbones. Temples. Oop. And under the chin. And then I'm just going to take a normal blush brush and just blend that out. Then I'm going to contour my nose and I'm just taking the two lighter shades of this bronzer to do that. And then for lips, what I wore to the wedding was my um, lipstick from NYX in Pure Nude just to balance out the boldness, but I'm going to give you some other lip options that you could use if you feel more bold and more colorful. So this is what the final look looks like. I like this lipstick option, but if you were feeling more bold, here are a few other ones I would suggest. Um, the next step up, I think, would be this pink color. It's just a lighter pink um, from Wet n Wild, and the color is Pink Ice. Or if you're feeling a little bit more adventurous, you can always do a step up and do the hot pink color. And mine is... What's the color of this? I don't know, but it's from Wet n Wild and it's number 511B. Don't know what the color is, because I don't think it says one. So that's the finished look, and if you liked it, give this video a thumbs up. Um, comment below if you want to see any more adventurous colors like this, and I'll film some more for you. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Okay, bye! It's time for the intro. Because we are going to apply, we're going to, oh. <laughs> mm. brush, 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 yeah, brush, brush. <laughs> okay, here, I'll do a swatch for you. Yeah, that's it.